Around 1.5 million workers across France took part in a national strike on December 5th. The workers were on the streets against French President Emmanuel Macron's regressive pension reforms. Demonstrations were organized in around 250 places across the country. The call for the strike was given by around 30 unions, including the General Confederation of Labour, Workers' Force, Solidaire, FSU, FIDL, MNL, UNL, etc. In Paris alone, 100,000 people took part in a march. Massive mobilizations were also held in Bordeaux, Lyon, Marcel, and Nantes. The protesters were repressed by the police who used tear gas and water cannons against them. In many places, groups of Yellow West protesters also joined the mobilizations. Emmanuel Macron plans to introduce a universal points-based pension system to replace the current 42 different systems across sectors with different kinds of benefits. According to the new proposal, from the year 2025, workers will have to toil till the age of 64 to avail of all the pension benefits. The current retirement age is 62. In the new system, the contributions of employees will be graded as points, which will then be used to calculate the pension amounts in euros. As of now, each point has not been given a specific valuation, as it is subject to fluctuations in the economy. This introduces a lot of uncertainty to the pensions and will lead to the withdrawal of benefits from many sectors. Les retraites, euh, bon, moi, je me dis que ça se trouve, j'en aurai jamais. Donc, euh, ça me. Voilà, je, je sais plus pour les gens qui vont l'avoir bientôt euh, que je manifeste. Et euh, c'est surtout que je suis désespérée en fait euh, tous les matins. Je pleure tous les matins en écoutant la, la, la radio. Et, euh, et voilà, j'ai pas du tout confiance en l'avenir. The CGT called the mobilization on December 5th historic. It demanded a fair reform of the pension system that takes into account the different types of work so that everyone can retire with full benefits. Political parties, including the French Communist Party, youth groups, including MJCF, and student groups, including UEC, participated in the national strike. Various trade unions in Europe also expressed solidarity with the French workers. We are trying to destroy it. That's why I'm here. Pour les retraites, mais les retraites, c'est le haut de l'iceberg. According to an online survey conducted by Harris Interactive on December 3rd, 69% of French citizens support the movement against the pension reform. French workers have been continuously protesting Macron's proposals. Huge protests were held on September 13th and September 24th against the so-called reform. Recently, on December 2nd, French firefighters had set up camps at the Place de la République in Paris against the reforms. Bien cantar que vamos a triunfar